Welcome back, everybody. It's time to lock down Arena, and today we are going to be playing with a Nikachu inspired deck that he posted on Twitter the other day. It's my own version of the deck. It's a little bit more Merfolk themed than what he had. He basically liked it because it played like Merfolk, but I want to add more Merfolk. And uh, I'm not a huge fan of some of the options he, he took, or at least not yet. I want to play test the deck still, so I'll run through it really quick for what I have. Uh, work in progress, obviously. Uh, we do have the four Curious Obsessions, three Mystical Caralds for now, three Siren Storm Tamers, two Spell Pierce, four Tricksters, four Shaper's Apprentice, four, two Silver Gill Adepts. I would like to add more of these. We'll see. Uh, we have two Surge Mares for now. I'm not convinced on this card yet. I get the benefits, and the card draw is very nice. I don't know how well it will vibe with the deck, but I want to try it. I'm going to give it a chance. Three Exclusion Mages. Two Kopalas, I think it's very strong and standard still against all the removal. Four Tempest Gems, full play set of these. Three Water Trap Weavers, and of course we have our Wizard's Retort. We have three of them in for now. I would like to add a fourth. And of course that is our counter target spell. If we control a wizard, it costs one less, basically turning it into a two drop counter target spell. As you can see, majority of our creatures are wizards. Weaver's a wizard. Kopala is, mage is... Adeptus, Apprentice, Trickster, and Storm Tamer are all wizards, so we should have no problem with getting our two drop counter spell in play. So we are going to jump into this thing here and see how it runs. Playtesting it still, so obviously I want to edit a few things out, put in some more full play sets, and see how it goes from there. So let's see how we do. I, ha I, I just got out of a game, just testing it out and playing with, playing with it a little bit. We'll keep this. And um, it worked really well. We didn't win the game, unfortunately. Uh, it was very close. We had the upper hand the whole time. I pulled out a, a nice attack play. And, uh, completely took us out in one sweep. That's unfortunate. But the deck played really well. And I was uh, very happy with that. I think we're going to drop Curious uh, Surge Mare. And put Curious Obsession on it. And then we can boost it if we choose. So let's do that. And in fact, I'm just going to hold up Trickster. We'll get that into play. Gonna let me resolve this curious obsession. Alright, cool. So we'll swing in for that. I do like the beefiness of Surge Mare. I definitely like this. Alright. Uh, could I have. Uh, I can beef him though. I do want to get this card draw, so I think I will do that. Yes. Take the action. Alright, we got another Surge Mare, so that's nice. And I think we're going to get rid of... Hmm... I think we'll get rid of a Trickster. I'd like to keep my island so I can play two things a turn. Okay, well, we got an island, so that's unfortunate. Uh, but, can't predict those things. War boss. Interesting. Ooh, okay, now we're flooding out a little bit. Gonna play another Surge Mare. We are going to move to attack. We're gonna probably lose our Curious Possession on this, but if he wants to block with something, uh, I'm okay with that. He is not, so 
I'm just gonna hit him for one. Because I'd like to play Merfolk Trickster next turn. So, we will take the action. Discard an island. Get our card draw. Alright. Let's uh, pass the turn to them. Pass to the attackers, he has to swing in. He's gonna do that as well. He could have some kind of lightning strike now to take him out, but... Yeah, that's unfortunate. Hmm... Well... I'm gonna play Trickster. him down. And we'll buff him. Swing in here. Okay, another Shapers. We're gonna get rid of our island. Get another card draw. Alright, Wizards Retort. Well, we could have that up. We'll start playing our Flyers next turn. spot here. Okay. We will trickster that next turn, so I'm going to go ahead and just leave this as it is. Pass the turn. Going off pretty nicely. He's just swinging with that guy. Which is interesting. But okay. I 
think we're gonna swing in here. If he blocks with the Phoenix, I'll trickster it. And then, uh... Should be able to tap it, it'll lose its ability so it won't come back. At least that's what I'm hoping for here. So let's see if that works. block so now I will do a trickster should lose its ability I hope I'll play this right okay <laughs> wow he is not happy about that oh man that uh I wanted to see how that game was gonna play out that's what I... <laughs> come on I took away your phoenix, so now you're just gonna be mad and just leave? <sighs> he sold a good board state. It would have been a good game, man. It would have been a fun game. He would have he would have traded with my gin. We would have both lost our big flyers. He still would have had a boatload of goblins with haste that he could mentor up. Uh, it was <sighs> man. That's frustrating. But uh the deck did pretty good, and I'm happy with how it played out. We got to use the Wizard's Retort. Uh, Tempest Gene came out. A lot of things came out from the deck. Uh, Surge Mare works better than expected. That was interesting. It was very interesting, I will say that. I do like the beefiness of Surge Mare. Yeah, I'm going to have to playtest it some more, but I hope you guys enjoyed. Stay tuned. We are going to be playing some Popper. And uh, we will be back with more of these merfolk wizards. Uh, if you guys enjoyed, let me know. Leave a like. See you next time.